thanks to all of our snacks, Axie. Those were for us to share. Mmm, yummy snacks. I need more snacks. More. How are we going to get more snacks now, Wudo? I think the only way we're going to is if we build a 7-Eleven, Mongo. Come on, Wudo. Let's start building a 7-Eleven right now. My 7-Eleven is going to be way better than yours, Wudo. I don't think so, Mongo. My 7-Eleven will be the biggest in the world with every snack imaginable. Let's start building it right over here in this nice big area. My 7-Eleven is going to have way better snacks than your guys is. No, it definitely won't, Mongo. We're going to have all types of different goodies and even some cool drinks like Prime. Wait, what, Budo? You know that Coca-Cola is way better than Prime. That's not true. Can you believe what this guy is saying, Axie? Prime is the greatest hydration drink ever. I don't really care, Wudo, as long as I have my snacks. Well, what type of snack is your favorite, Axie? We can put down Oreos or maybe some cookies. Oreos? Did you just say Oreos? I love Oreos. Well, we'll have plenty of those in there, Axie. Don't you worry about it. Look at how great our 7-Eleven's coming along already. I'm about to put the logo on the front door. The logo? Whoa, put it down right now. All I need to do is just grab this graffiti and then I can select the logo from right here. Whoa, isn't that logo so magical? It looks so good. I could almost eat it. Well, I don't think you should be the first to try, Axie. Okay, so um, when can I eat my snacks? We can't put down any snacks if the inside isn't even built yet. So I think to finish this off, I'm going to go ahead and grab my trusty wand tool so that I can go all the way out here like this and select these two blocks to fill in the rest of the walls. Voila! Voila! It's definitely bigger than Marco's. No, my 7-Eleven is gigantic and the inside side that has so many snacks that Wudo could never have. Mongo, is that your 7-Eleven? That looks like a 612. It's so ugly. Wudo never judge a book by its cover. That's the number one lesson. Well, our 7-Eleven is looking spectacular and still 10 times better than Mongo's dirty 7-Eleven. It's looking delicious. Well, our 7-Eleven isn't gonna be the only delicious thing, Axie. It's time to work on the inside and actually put down our delicious snacks. Snacks? Did I hear the word snacks? You heard the word snacks, Axie. So I'm gonna start grabbing some shelves that we need in order for us to put our snacks up, Axie. For example, check out these white shelves I got. Let's start putting them down right over here. Okay. What snacks are gonna be over here. Well, Axie, I was thinking that we should start off with the most basic snacks of all, and those are candy and chips, my favorite snacks personally. I like all of them, but especially Oreos. Oreos? Well, you better start placing them down, Axie. We have all this shelving space exactly for that. Ooh, let's start with the chocolate. I may have taken a little nibble out of it, but that's fine, right? Axie, I don't know if you should be nibbling the chocolate bars, but let's just tell the customers that that's how they came. Now we can line the shelves with our chocolate. Doesn't that look sick? Yeah, and I'll also add some of the candy I stole earlier. Ooh. Oh yeah, those candies are looking awesome, Axie. I wonder if there's any other chocolate bars I can put, or even candy bars. How about some cotton candy and maybe even some candy canes? Does that sound tasty, Axie? I was just putting on some candy canes too. Let's have some of the blue ones and maybe some of the green ones. Oh yeah, how about cotton candy as well? Cotton candy is so delicious, Axie. I do love cotton candy candy. I love the way it just melts when you eat it. That's right. It does melt in your mouth and that's why it's the tastiest.
yes. But we're going to run out of shelving space soon, Axie. I better work on putting some other shelves on the back, too. Okay, Woodle. While you do that, I'm going to keep stocking up on candy. How much more candy could there possibly be, Axie? Which other candies are your favorite? Well, I like candy corn, but usually I only eat it on Halloween. How about this candy, Axie? It's called cupcake candy, and they look like cupcakes. Is there one that looks like normal cakes? Well, Axie, why do we need a fake cake when we can have actual cake? We'll work on a bakery section, too, just for you. Yay! But where do the chips go, Wudo? On this side? They should go on the same side as the candies, Axie. I'm just going to search for chips. And luckily, we have some tortilla chips that we can put on the shelves as well. These chips go great with some salsa and guacamole. I have some salsa right here, but it's in a bowl. Oh, yeah. I should probably put some cheese sauce, too. There's so many different cheese types I can pick from, Axie. Let's put the super realistic cheese down. Doesn't that look silly? It's kind of scary, Woodle. Look at all those holes. Well, instead of that, Axie, you know what I also like to put right on top of my tortillas? More tortillas? No, silly. How about some raw sugar just so you can eat it plain as it is and get all the energy from it? That looks amazing. Can I eat it? No, Axie. If you eat it, you're going to get very, very sick. We have to make sure that we only have a little bit. But I have to say, this first shelf is looking quite tasty. And now we have some other shelves to work on, too. But I wonder how Mongo 7-Eleven is coming along. Hey, Mongo. How many shelves do you have in your 7-Eleven, huh? A bunch more than you, Woodo. That's all I know. Oh, yeah? Well, what are you selling in there? I bet you don't have every single chocolate bar in the world like we do. Oh, wait, Woodo. You just gave me an idea. I'm gonna add chocolate bars. Woodo, you're giving away all our secrets. Huh? How did you not already have chocolate bars? Isn't that like the most important thing to sell in a 7-Eleven? No, it's soda and Sprite. Hey, Wudo, I think we should go into Mongo 7-Eleven and replace all the items on the shelves with weird things. You want to go do that right now? Yeah, he'll never see it coming. Let's do it, Axie. Let's just take a second to admire how amazing our 7-Eleven is before we go get infected by his stinky one. Quick, let me go and grab an invisibility potion so he can't see that we're there. Yay! Yay! I'm going to go collect some dirt to put in his place. Oh, Mongo, what are you working on now? There you go. I just finished the first floor of my second 11, but I'm going to make a bottom floor. I bet Wudo 7-Eleven isn't going to have this. Wait, did Mongo just call his 7-Eleven a second 11? This guy doesn't even know what he's building. So, Axie, let's start replacing everything with some really nasty stuff. I'm going to put some poop over here. And then next to it, I'm going to put turtle eggs. Because who eats turtle eggs? Ew, poop is so nasty, Axie. But it would also be really funny. So let's just take all the food off the shelves and put more doo-doo. Ew. Doo-doo. So disgusting. I wonder if there's anything else we can put in here, too. How about some really weird boiled fish, Axie? This stuff looks disgusting. Ew. Wait, actually, that looks pretty good. Axie, are you serious? That does not look tasty. Maybe you axolotls are used to eating it, but I know that I'm not used to it. It just looks disgusting. But I think that pretty much aches all the food inside his 7-Eleven. Super nasty. Let's see if he can smell the poop from all the way up here. There you go. I just finished my bathroom down here, which means... I can go up here and start my 7-Eleven day and wait, what? Why is there poop all over the place? I don't remember pooping this much. <laughs> look at Mongo. He's freaking out because of all the doo-doo. Wait, he took it all down. Aw, 
I'm just gonna have to put more up. Quickly, I have to place back my sodas and stuff before Huda and them come over to my side. Why is Manga concerned about us, Axie? He should be concerned about some actual customers. Let's make him think that his 7-Eleven is super popular and spawn in a bunch of villagers. Yeah, and they'll see all the poop and they'll be super ashamed. They're gonna give so many bad reviews. Oh my gosh, I have so many customers. Guys, don't worry. My 7-Eleven will be open soon. But right now it's not, which means you guys need to get out of here right now. <laughs> Look at this, Axie. I just locked all the villagers inside of Mongo 7-Eleven. And now he has to worry about getting rid of all of them. Get out of my 7-Eleven. Why is he hitting his customers with a sword? That's bad customer service. We better put a warning sign up to tell everyone not to come to his 7-Eleven. It's way too dangerous. Get out, you pesky villagers. Leave, leave, leave. Oh, my gosh, Axie. I think we've done enough destruction for now. How about we go back to our normal, amazing 7-Eleven and we start working on some other things that we need to make it the best? I'm going to start making the poop aisle. The poop aisle? Okay, Axie. You can do that, but I actually want to work on a different section of my 7-Eleven. I want to start putting down some baked goods. Remember how I talked about how we would put down cookies and bread and cakes? Yeah, is it time for the cake? It's time for it, Axie. And I'm going to put it on these shelves right over here. So let me just grab some cakes real quick. And I'll also grab some delicious cookies too. Let's put cookies of all different types. For example, some oatmeal cookies, some cranberry cookies, ooh, even some sweet berry cookies. All oh, these cookies look so delicious. That sounds so tasty. I want to eat them all. We can even put down some cookie dough so that our customers can even take it home and bake it if they want to by themselves. That's amazing, Woodle. Look at what I built. I think it's even better. Ooh, you made a weird food aisle, Axie. Sure, I guess that's pretty cool in itself. But come on, I want to put down as many cookies as possible to satisfy all the amazing customers that are going to come to our side for the delicious cookies. I'm gonna eat them all. Look, Axie, I can even put a persimmon cookie and I can put an egg cookie. What in the world? That just looks like eggs. I want to eat it so bad, Woodle. Are we done? Can I have my free snacks yet? You can't have your free snacks just yet, Axie. You forgot about the cakes. I thought you loved that part. I do love cakes. Okay, it's time to put down all kinds of cake. Let's go ahead ahead and grab some cakes, Axie, and we can put them right on top and on the other side of the aisle so that we have as many places to show off our delicious sweets as we can. Oh, wow, Woodle. What kinds of cakes are those? Well, I'm putting down every single cake imaginable, Axie. Just check out what's in my inventory. Coffee cake, redstone cake, cookie cake, slime cake, and I'm gonna stack even more cakes on top. Up. These are going to be the ultra mega rare ones. I have the best kind of cake, and it's a pancake. A pancake, Axie? Oh, wait, I get it. Because it's literally a pancake, right? Look at it. It's so funny. Oh, my gosh, Axie. That is such a good idea. Let's stack up some more pancakes on this side, too. Oh, my gosh, they're going so high up. Don't worry, Woodle. No matter how high up they go, I can eat them all in one bite. Oh, trust me, Axie. I don't need to worry about you. I know that you could do that. But look, now we have our delicious cookies and cakes on this side so that our customers can enjoy the delicious baked goods that we have to offer. Yay! What do we make now? Well, Axie, we just put down a lot of packaged food. Maybe it's time for us to make some fresh food too. Let's go over here to the back side. And how about I grab some trap doors so that we can put down some barrels filled with some fruits and vegetables. That sounds cool, Woodle. But I don't just want fruits and vegetables. I also want unhealthy stuff like soda. 
soda okay axie we can also have soda but first we need to be just a little bit more healthy so let me just put these food displays up and then what we can do is we can grab all the natural things like some apples and lettuce how about some carrots too carrots i do like carrots only because pigs like them though <laughs> there you go axie i just put down plenty of fresh delicious food it's good to make sure that you have some healthy food once in a while too otherwise all that sugar is gonna make you really chubby and you don't want that to happen it takes a lot to make an axolotl chubby wudo oh yeah yup i've already eaten like twenty thousand cakes today and i'm not chubby yet really are you sure you actually ate twenty thousand axie two ten twenty thousand it's all the same all right axie well how about you help me put down some more fruits and vegetables over here and right next to that i can start putting some other things as well how about we put our slushy machine here oh slushies i love slushies Check this out, Axie. We're gonna have plenty of slushies now. Doesn't this machine look super duper cool? It does look really cool. But how does it refrigerate the drinks? Don't worry about it, Axie. It's some really cool technology. But while we're here, we might as well put some advertisement advertising our slushies, too. I want everyone in our 7-Eleven to know how amazing our slushies are. Yay! Even Mongo's gonna have to admit that we have the best slushies. Exactly! So check this out, Axie. I'm putting the advertisement in the back over here. Doesn't that look tasty? It looks so good. I'm gonna eat it. Um, yum, 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 yum. Hey, Axie! You can't eat the advertisement. The advertisement is for our customers, not for you to eat, silly. You're right. It only really tastes like paper. Exactly. If you want a real slushie, you're gonna have to get one from the machine machine okay okay we might as well put some other advertisements too look this is a refreshing 7-eleven coffee and tea that they can also get from the slushy machine that makes sense Woodle. let me see if i can find some cups so that customers can get their slushies look axie i already placed them down doesn't that look super nice that does i can't wait to get a million free slushies Let's put down our other advertisements too, Axie. Maybe we can promote a hot dog so that our customers will eat from our hot food area too. Woodo, I'm selling cookies outside my 7-Eleven. Do you want to buy them to sell in your 7-Eleven? Wait, what? Mongo, did you just turn into a Girl Scout? What is this? No, they're specially baked cookies that I built in my bathroom. Uh, Mongo, wait, look over there. I think there's a monster. A monster! Quick, Axie, let's replace all his cookies with more doo-doo. Come on! I'm gonna take some for myself. All right, let me just break all of these. And now I can just put a bunch of brown dye right on top. And now let's ask Mongo why he's selling poop in three, two, one. Hey, Mongo! Why did all your cookies turn into doo-doo? Ew! I think it's because I used the poop ingredient. Oh, gosh. Axie, run! That 7-Eleven is cursed! He really was selling poop. Woodle, I don't know if I want to eat these cookies anymore. You should definitely break those, Axie. How about instead we work on our refrigerators so that we can put down some cold drinks for all of our customers to enjoy? Okay, but before that, I'm burning these cookies. Oh, gosh, Axie, don't start a fire at our 7-Eleven. Then otherwise, there will be no customers to serve at all. And then it'll be a zero-zero. Exactly. So look, I'm putting down these refrigerators and freezers using these glass doors. Now what I can do is I can grab some shelves again that we can put down our sodas and drinks. Whoa, are we going to put the shelves inside the refrigerator? Yep, that's exactly how it's going to work, Axie. You see this? 
Oops, that looks super cool. And then to keep it nice and cold, we'll put a bunch of ice on the bottom as well. Can I start adding the soda and drinks? Yep, there should be a bunch of different soda options, Axie. How about you grab us some delicious ones like Coca-Cola and Fanta and Sprite? I don't know about those. Let me see. Okay, Woodo, I have the soda and I'm going to start placing them down. You do, Axie? Go ahead and put them all down, okay? It's going to be so good. Wow, look, Coca-Cola, Fanta, Sprite. Sprite and Pepsi. You really found everything, Axie. I have some Dr. Pepper, too. And then for people who don't like brand soda, I have some orange soda here. And I'm going to put on some lemon lime soda, grape soda, and cherry soda. Ooh, that sounds great. Well, guess what, Axie? I'm actually going to go down here on this side. And what I'm going to put down are ice creams. Ice creams? What kind of ice cream? All types of ice cream. Chocolate chip, glow berry, golden apple, and even honey ice cream. Don't those sound really tasty? They do sound really good, and I get to eat them all for free. And now look, Axie, our entire refrigerator section is all done. We actually have so much food and snacks inside of our 7-Eleven, but now I think it's time for us to build the checkout area so that our customers can actually buy their stuff. Okay, let me just make the toilet paper section first. Toilet paper section? Okay, Axie, I guess you can make these shelves filled with other things that people would need for their everyday lives. And while you do that, I'll go and build the checkout counters. Okay, Woodle, sounds good. Do you think people need bikinis for their everyday lives? Bikinis? I don't know about that, Axie, but you know what? It wouldn't hurt to have it. Yay! So go ahead and add some bikinis, Axie. And while you do that, I'll just finish putting these counters up here for the checkout area. Sounds good, Woodo. Now that I put down my amazing conveyor belt, I can also put down my checkout machine, where it'll calculate the cost of all the foods and stuff that our customers ordered. That's pretty cool, Woodo. Right now, I'm putting down a bunch of different kinds of kelp. Kelp? Wait, what? Why would we need kelp, Axie? I don't know. It's part of the swimming section. Okay, you know what? I think there's still something else that I need to do, too. Remember how 7-Eleven has a bunch of hot dogs and stuff that you can buy? Oh, yeah. I forgot about that. Well, I want to sell hot dogs, too. So, let me go ahead and grab some some trap doors, and what we can do is put down a bunch of them to buy. I'm gonna buy all of them, Wudo. You are? I don't think you can, though, Axie, because otherwise, I won't have anything to serve to the customers. Don't worry about it. I'm your only customer. Okay, Axie, you know what? I'm gonna just start putting down the hot dogs. Let me get the burger, the hot dog, and let me see what other food could I sell here, Axie? Um, I don't know. Maybe I can also sell some sushi. Maybe you can also sell some mud to put on the sushi. What? That doesn't sound very healthy, Axie. That sounds like it would be dangerous for our customers. No, mud is filled with good nutrients from the earth. Okay, Axie. Well, there is one thing that I probably would want to sell to make sure our customers don't get sick, though, and that is a bathroom. Can you help me build a bathroom real quick too, Axie? Nature is my bathroom, Wudo. And right now, this 7-Eleven is looking a lot like nature. Axie, do not poop in the 7-Eleven, please. Okay, where do you want the bathroom to go? Well, I think you should put it in the back over here. Maybe you can build a little room over on this side, okay? While I go ahead and finish up the hot food area. Wow, that food actually Actually looks really really tasty let me just block off this area to make sure none of the customers can go behind the counter and so that we can prepare all the food ourselves okay Woodo, fast food bathrooms are supposed to be really gross right no silly we don't want it to be gross because then our customers would just leave huh, so they don't do it on purpose 
No, of course not. I think what you're talking about are some crazy people, Axie. Oh, I see. See, so the customers are the crazy ones. Exactly. But come on, the last thing I need to do is just put some tables so that our customers have some places to enjoy the food that they just purchased in case they don't want to go do it outside and on the street or something like that. Ew, that's gross. Exactly, Axie. So I'm just putting down these last couple chairs and then I can block off this checkout area too so that now you'll be able to buy all of your stuff and then enjoy whatever snack you want and then come in and out the 7-eleven whenever you'd like that sounds good Wudo. anyway how do you like having like three toilets next to each other people won't mind pooping while sitting next to strangers right i don't think they will axie now the last thing i need to do is just put up some delicious advertisements so that our customers know if there's a bargain that they can get i'm just gonna go grab this one over here and then i'm gonna put a bunch more on the walls as well for example this nice delicious sandwich that's on sale for only three dollars only three dollars but for me it's zero dollars right exactly axie that is if we get a lot of customers oh we'll get so many customers or one very hungry axolotl uh-oh and that one actually kind of scares me axie what if that axolotl goes crazy then you'll just have to keep feeding her woodle oh gosh i don't like the sound of that but you know what i think i'm almost done putting down all the advertisements i'm just gonna put a couple more down over here to make sure that everyone knows what's on sale and voila i think i put down all of them yay i just need the bathroom door and then that's done as well Ooh, the bathroom door or don't make it seat their Axie. Our customers need their privacy. Okay, I was gonna use a glass door, but I guess I won't. All right, Axie. And while you finish that up, I'm just gonna put the roof on top of our 7-Eleven too. And now check it out. This is the coolest 7-Eleven that I have ever seen in my life. And it even has a fancy bathroom. Can I just make it a little bit see-through? Axie, I guess you can. But quick, we're really running out of time. Let's go see if Mongo 7-Eleven's really any better than ours. There's no way our 7-Eleven looks so good. Hey, Mongo, we're coming to see your 7-Eleven. Are you ready, guys? First of all, in the front, I have my cookies, as you saw earlier. Then when you go inside, I'm going to be at the cash register, and you guys can buy whatever you want. There's all sorts of items oh i see but is this all your selection mongo this is kind of boring what do you mean you don't need any other selection pick what you want Wudo. i'll charge you nothing today um can i have this chocolate bar i'm gonna eat everything nom, 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 nom. all right all right guys you can have the whole store but once you're done eating everything you should come down to the bathroom um, Mongo, what are these weird stains on the ground? Ew, I hope that's ketchup, Axie. But what is that? Is that poop? Ew! This is my bathroom. Escape, Axie. We need to go to a proper one. So, how about what I do is I quickly grab a shopping cart that we can go and sit in so that we can get to our 7-Eleven quickly. Get me out! I'm coming with you guys. Let's go. Mongo, now that you're in a shopping cart, you can come into our amazing 7-Eleven and buy whatever you'd like. Check it out. This first section is dedicated to all our candy and chips. No way. I think I'm definitely going to need some of these. Let me grab a chocolate bar real quick, along with some pink candy. And wait a second. Is that cheese? I love cheese. Well, 
you can buy that too, Monko. And then you can come over here and get some baked goodies as well. We have a bunch of different cookie flavors and cakes. But if you need some other everyday things, you can get some toilet paper and plungers that Axie put down. And kelp and mushrooms and people's heads. I think that I'm definitely going to need these plungers, guys. So let me just grab those along with some toilet paper and some fishies. There you go. I'm done with this aisle. My row is the best. Well, why don't you come back here, Mongo? We also have some other cakes, but we also have our fresh food. Apples, melons, grapes, and oranges, and even some carrots and lettuce. Go ahead and pick out whatever you want. No way. I'm going to take all the melons and all the apples. Yummy. And now you can get a delicious drink as well, Mongo. We have Diet Coke, Fanta, Pepsi, and even ice cream too. Go ahead and get whatever you want. I think I'll take the entire stock of drinks. Oh my gosh, that's a lot. But wait, Mongo, did you see this advertisement over here? Why don't you go and get a slushy? Slushy? Oh my gosh, I want a slushy. Come over here, Mongo. Go. This is our slushing machine. Pick out whichever one you want. I want the entire machine for my 7-Eleven. Wait, what? I guess you can buy that, Mongo. Sure. Now, last thing. Would you like any hot food from our hot food section? We have hot burgers, hot dogs, and sushi. 7-Eleven hot dogs are the best hot dogs ever. I would like three of those, please. All right. Here is three for you, Mongo. Okay, there you go. Can I please check out now? Yep, just put all your items on the conveyor belt, Mongo. All right, here you go. These are everything I want to buy. Let me not forget the soda. There you go. And boom. All right, Mongo. Let me just go to my checkout machine. Beep, boop, 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 boop. And your total comes out to $10,000, sir. Okay, I have one grab. Block. Uh, Axie, do we accept that as currency? No, we do not. And I have just the thing for times like these. Axie, what is that? Can I please get my food already, guys? I need to go back home. Sir, I have to ask you to leave the premises. Wait, what? Are you kicking me out? Why? Take this! Oh, gosh, no! Goodbye, Mongo! Our 7-Eleven was the Woohoo! Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed, then watch another video on screen and don't forget to subscribe. Bye! Bye.